In these challenging times, we must seek out effective leadership. We can no longer afford to elect people to high office who are more interested in their own reelection than meeting the needs of our community. Today's challenges call for a leader, a leader who's capable, honorable, reliable, admirable, and electable. He grew up in Farmington Hills in the heart of the 9th Congressional District. His parents instilled in him at a young age the importance of public service. At 11, he worked on his first political campaign. At age 17, he enlisted in the U.S. Army Reserve, kicking off a distinguished military career, fighting for freedom on the front line of the War on Terror. He's a graduate of Harrison High School with an undergraduate degree in psychology, master's work, and eventually his law degree. He achieved all this while serving his country and serving his state. His service included four years as an infantryman reaching the rank of sergeant. In 1990, he attended officer candidate school where he received his commission and became a second lieutenant in the infantry. He has served in many leadership and command positions and is currently a major. He's a paratrooper and certified pathfinder. In 1996, he was elected to serve in the Michigan House of Representatives. After winning re-election in 1998, he was chosen by his fellow legislators to serve as the youngest majority leader in the nation. He waged a spirited battle against Senator Carl Levin in a campaign that gave him valuable experience building coalitions, raising money, and running a statewide campaign. He's also a successful businessman, CEO of Star Tickets, a Michigan company with a national footprint, serving the ticketing and entertainment industries. You may know him as your state representative, a successful businessman, a neighbor, or as a soldier proudly serving the country he loves, protecting our freedom in faraway lands. On the day he was born, they called him Andrew. Andrew Rocky Rushkovsky. And like his namesake in the movies, our Rocky is ready to fight again, ready to take that journey up those famous steps, the steps of the U.S. Capitol, as our next U.S. Congressman in Michigan's 9th District. Paid for by Rocky for Congress.